Hello, sweeties. Welcome to the very first episode of Let's Play The Sims 3, The Polygamy Challenge. I am going to try and use camera controls to give you an idea of the house. Now, if you have, um, if you've seen the speed build I did of the house, then you are already familiar with it. But I'm going to see if I can, if I can do this. Um, we're on, I don't know what side of the house that we're on. Um, the house itself was built on, um, facing a direction that was not toward the street so we're just kind of gonna gonna go through um now i'm i'm kind of really proud of the house uh i know that it's not the best but um let's go ahead and take it down a couple of levels maybe One too many. All right. All right, so we're gonna go through the front door, maybe. If I can, if I can get through here. Now, I think the portal has already arrived. I'm not sure, um, but it doesn't matter. Um, oh, there's a puddle that somebody is gonna want to mop up. Um, we're going through the foyer. Um, there are no babies yet, but um, the first sim that we're going to meet it, Okay, go down. Whoa. Alright. Me, just kind of, sorry if y'all get sick. All right, where are you, Dina? Okay, this right here, wearing the futuristic clothes. I'm probably going to change, not going to lie. Um, it's not that I don't like it, it's just that it doesn't fit this challenge. Um, She is a heavier girl. Okay, anyway, this is Dina. Oh, well, now, of course, it's not going to work. She is the last and most recent wife of Travis. She's a couch potato. She's a slob. She can't stand art. She's family oriented and she's a green thumb. Uh, her favorite music is rockabilly. Uh, her favorite food is a hamburger and her favorite color is Irish green. She is a Virgo and she has 23 days until she ages up. Um, she is the youngest. Um, but Travis married her for love, even though he, she can't stand art and she's completely messy and she's a couch potato. Um, but Travis is Travis married her for love. Um, I don't know what about her he loves. Maybe it's that she is family oriented and she is a green thumb. I don't know if it's because she has the lifetime wish of being surrounded by family, which, uh, Travis does also. Um, moving on to the first wife, if I can. Oh, I went too far. Okay. Let's do then. She, Dina, is the second youngest, and she is the first wife. The first wife and Travis hope. Um, 
Tra Travis was made to marry Hope. Um, can't really get a good look at her right now because she's cooking. Um, but she hates the outdoors. She's family oriented, artistic. She is a diva and she's mean spirited. Um, she's not perfect by any means. And Travis married her because his parents set it up. Um, right now she's making pancakes. Uh, her favorite color is pink. She loves cheese steak and her favorite music is French and she's a Taurus. Uh, and she has a lifetime wish of mastering the painting skill and the guitar skill. Um, and she has 24 days until she ages up. Travis is the patriarch of the family, and he's playing chess right now uh, with his uh, second wife, whom he also married for love. Uh, Travis is a workaholic, neurotic, he's over-emotional, family-oriented, and he's a schmoozer. His lifetime wish is to uh, be surrounded by family, and he is an Aries. He loves pop music, uh, do surprise, and the color orange, and he also has 24 days until he ages up. Um... So that is Travis. Uh, right now he's thinking really hard. I don't know if I can get in to him. Wrong way. This is not going well. Um, and last but not least, we have the oldest, Meryl uh, Littleton, who is playing chess. She is socially awkward. She's family-oriented, hot-headed, neat, and a genius. She has 23 days until she ages up, and she is a Libra. Uh, her lifetime wish is... Also, to be surrounded by family. Um, she loves roots, stew surprise, and the color aqua. Um, now, let me tell you about this challenge. Um, this challenge is, is going to be difficult. Uh, there are a lot of rules. Um, And basically what it says, um, and this challenge is located at Mod The Sims, there will be a link to the rules um, in the uh, in the down bar below. Um, but this is the polygamy challenge. It isn't an open marriage or a swingers challenge though, sorry. The polygamy is based on religious practices, so some religious rules will have to be obeyed by your sims as well. There are a number of faiths and cultures in the real world that have plural marriages, so you can either base your sims on one of them, a mixture of them, or come up with something yourself. There are guidelines, however. Uh, to complete this challenge, you will have to either use a No Jealousy and or Multiple Marriages mod. There are several out there. Only one marriage needs to be recognized, though. So, it's not required that the other spouses be listed as wives. Romantic, romantic interests will do. Or, if you have the World Adventures mod, you can use a cheat to give... Um, I don't know. Yeah, okay. Um, anyway, um, basically, you can use cheats to give yourself the home, uh, that you'll use for the rest of the challenge. You can renovate, of course, as needed, but no moving from the challenge after that. And, um, what 
what I did is I only built one part of the compound um, because uh, well because I thought it would be easier however um, go away Uh, the compound is rather large. There will be three houses in the end. And they will all look different. Um, so. It is on a 64 by 64 lot, I think. Uh, so there is plenty of space. Uh, each wife gets one third or one quarter of the property. The last quarter of the property will be used eventually as a large um, a large garden um, because they will need to uh, become self-sufficient. Um, now the first wife is not very happy about having to share her home but she understands having grown up in uh, in the religion that you know sacrifices have to be made even though she's not really happy about that um, now uh, what's her name hope is the uh, is the diva and she believes that she is better than the other two because um, because Travis married her first. Now, what she doesn't understand is that um, Travis had to marry her. He had no choice in the matter. It was an arranged marriage. And as a result, he has no real... I mean, he loves her and he wants to have children of her with her because that is um, that is what he was raised to believe. Um, he is a fundamental Mormon, um, and for those of you who don't know what a fundamental Mormon is, it it is um, it's not an offshoot of Mormonism. It is what happened prior to. Uh, the modern uh, Latter-day Saints, whatchamacallit, and um, basically, uh, fundamental Mormon, fundamental Mormonism, um, they believe in the sanctity or in the principle. The principle is uh, basically plural wives. Um, They believe that the more um, the more family you have, the more um, the more children that you have, the more that you bring into the world, the the better you are received when you die. Um, so um, it was believed at one point, and by some, it is still believed that. Um, that you are, that they're, um, let's go ahead and get back into, um, live mode. Um, now, I know that I'm jumping around a lot here, and, um, so, they are going there, Oh, hang on, guys. I'm going to be interrupted here in a minute. That was my son. Sorry for the interruption, guys. Um, he brought me a soda. Sorry about that. Um, we're going to be running a little long in the tooth for this episode. Um, now, there are a lot of rules. Um... One of the and some of them I'm not going to uh, I'm not going to follow as closely as the others. Um, it says that once 
uh, once I have the house and I need to use the family funds cheat to reduce the available money down to 500 simoleons. Um, and if the game starts on my cho chosen holy day, which it is not, um, my chosen holy day is going to be um, Sunday, which happens to coincide with leisure day. Um, and the way that it works, the, the way that this challenge works is that the husband... Um, the husband is the head of the household. He is the only one that is allowed to have a real job. Um, so I've decided that he's going to be a doctor. Um, and he's working right now on his logic skill to get it up so that he can get a, uh, hopefully get a promotion um, soon. Uh, he has, okay, so... Um, so we have to have a holy day, and I've decided that it is going to be Sunday. Sunday, he will not be... <sighs> Riley. Blackhead. Okay. Um, so... We have to have a holy day, okay? And Sunday is the holy day. It is going to fall on Sunday every time. No matter what, um, Travis is the only one allowed to have a real job. Um, the others cannot have any sort of profession. However, I have a mod that allows um, Sims to be self-employed, so I may be considering that. For instance, um, uh, Dina has a wish to be to join the writer career um, and not that she has a wish however um, she would do you're not gonna pillow fight with Dina she would do very well in uh, uh, artistically for instance being a painter or a sculptor she already has one uh, painting skill and one guitar skill so you know she she would probably do very well with uh, with being um, in the painter career or and uh, Dina she has two logic skills already um, and she is basically going to become the tutor of the children that are born um, she's going to uh, she might run a daycare service I don't I don't know um, but I, I want all of them to be contributing to the um, to the household funds um, not only will Dina join the painter career but she is going to be the gardener uh, so she could either be a gardener or a paint um, a writer I'm not sure which now um, we can sell these cameras because they don't need them although I'm gonna let Dina keep hers because she could use it to take pictures and whatnot and you're supposed to start out with 500 simoleons however um, I started out with 500 each because I do have a large property and she does have a lot I just want to be able to cover bills um, that is the only reason why I, I allowed them to have five or rather uh, 2,000 simoleons um, now they have their relationship all up um, each um, each one of the wives are his best friends and the reason why you're seeing three um, three wives and three wedding rings is because I have a mod that allows me to have more than one wife um, now 
the others don't know this, but Travis is in the market for another another wife. He hasn't discussed it with his family yet, but he is in the market for another wife, and they they don't know that yet. I haven't decided who it's going to be. It, it might very well be Muriel here. Um, and he, she might not even know that he's interested in her. I don't know. Um, but at some point, he is going to... Uh, he's going to sign up for the online dating. Um, because, you know, he... He is, he's a virile young man, and he, he wants, he wants to populate the world with his children. Um, now, the rules state that you can only, he can only have children with his wives. So, and he must try to impregnate his wives on a daily basis, and they need to take turns, which means, um, today is Thursday, and since it's day one, not really day one as in in the game, but since I'm recording on uh, on Thursday and this is the first time that I'm recording, um, the first night he will spend with his first wife, Hope. And then tomorrow night, Friday night, he will spend with his second wife, Meryl. And for... Uh, Saturday night he will spend with his third wife and so on and so forth. He must he must um, woohoo with his um, with his wives. Uh, he is allowed to kiss and hold hands and flirt and, and, and whatever with the rest of his with his other wives on any given day, it doesn't matter, but, um, the specific day belongs to the, uh, whichever wife, whichever day it is. So, for instance, if, um, the patriarch, it says the, the patriarch must divide his time among his wives equally, showing no favoritism. This means that it's, you must make a schedule and stick to it. Um, and I figure that filming a day at a time will help me keep to the schedule. Um, so today is uh, is Hope's day. So when he gets home from work, um, she he will have to woo her um, and try for a baby. Um, they they will have to try. There is no just woohoo. It is try for a baby. He may not try for a baby with any other wife who is not scheduled for that day. If it is wife's number one's turn that day, the patriarch cannot woohoo with wife number two. However, kissing and hugging and, and flirting and keeping up the relationship is fine. They can go on dates. It just, you, you have to... Um, you have to keep the woohoo for that day specifically to the wife. Um, now, this is episode one, so it is uh, Hope's day. So later on today, they will woohoo at some point. Um, I'm going to go ahead and try, I'm going to basically speed through it. Um, what is she doing? Is she just standing? She's just standing there like a dork. Okay, so let's come and check the mail, if, see if there's anything. Uh, we'll accept gifts, and then we will... And I'm gonna put this on speed too. Oh, lovely noise. And then... Um, oh, goodness! Alright, sorry, I nearly lost my headphones. Um, now, there are a bunch of other rules, and I am going to go over them one at a time, but not, not right now. They each have multi-tabs, 
Um, it doesn't say anything in the rules that you cannot have a multi-tab. Um, so, um, so I'm going to pause it because it's obviously taking a while. I'm lagged for some reason. And I'm lagged by the bees. Isn't that marvelous? Um, finally, thank you. Okay, she's going to... She's going to come out here and smoke the box and feed the bees and clean the box. And she's going to come out here and feed the chickens, harvest the eggs. Uh, um, and ask why a chicken is like a writing desk. I have no idea why. And then she is going to come in. She's going to water. Maybe. She's going to water. And that'll be enough for her for now. Um, hope is making pancakes um they also have to um once a day on the holy day um on the holy day they have to read out of the, um, they have to read out of their holy book. Well, I had a very difficult time choosing a book for them to use as their holy book, so I ended up choosing three. So they must read, they don't have to read every book on their holy day, but they need to read at least one of these books for an hour. Um, their holy books are The Dream of Jerome, uh, Hymn of Festive Stone, and The Secret History of Lost Lumeria. Um, now, they, 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 they're not religious books per se. Um, I don't think The Sims has religious books. However, um, in his, wow, okay. Why is there so many? Oh, he's she's he was gonna go consign. Um, I'm gonna make her consign. Um, now when they're pregnant, they have to stay away from apples and watermelon. I cannot force the situation um, that it has to be completely random um, so she's our gardener I'm going to register her as a uh, I, I can't decide if I want to register her as a gardener or or as a writer she wants to join the writer career so I might do that she's going to be no well, you know, maybe, maybe because Meryl is a bookworm. Is she a bookworm? No, but she is a genius. So she can hack the computer and she can, she can be a writer. Um, yeah. And, and he is going to learn the writing skill as well because he wants to write their family Bible-ish, whatever. Um, anyway, uh... I know that this episode is running long, so it has been 30 minutes. What I'm going to do is I'm going to end this episode here, and, um, actually, no. I'm going to play, play through the day, um, and I will, uh, start up again, uh, later on after he gets home from work, um, because he does have to work today in three hours. So I'm just going to speed through and um, 
and I will catch up with you when when uh, the day is when he gets home from work. And welcome back, sweeties. Um, so right now, um, I have I have uh, Meryl talking to this gentleman to see if he can. If, if he is knowledgeable enough, knowledgeable and possibly um, play with her, she uh, she's decided to join the chess career. Um, and basically, what that means is that she plays chess for a living. She wants to be, um, in addition to raising a family. I mean, she wants to. Um, She uh, she wants to um, be a grandmaster, and basically what that means is chess grandmasters have reached the coveted fifth level of the competitive chess circuit. There, they sit upon their throne, gazing downwards upon their victims. Choose that those who engage ch grandmasters in chess improve their abilities in logic and chess more quickly. Um, she also uh, wants to spend 20 hours, to, she wants to complete these challenges, is, is what I'm saying, um, and in order to do that, you know, gotta join the chess career, you gotta, you know, tutor children, you gotta browse, search the, um, the, with the telescope, and discover the potions, and, and all of that, so, um, she's gonna be busy doing that, she got a, wish to um wish to do the bot building skill and i might have her do that i don't know she wants to have a baby with travis which is amazing because you know she also wants to write a science fiction novel you know she's got a lot of wishes that she wants to fulfill so we're going to go ahead and get going here and um he is at the consignment store right now uh, looking for a gift for his wife or one of his wives he found a painting so he's gonna go ahead and give that to um, give that to uh, hope maybe she'll like it maybe she won't I don't know um, she has one finished painting she's gonna let that appreciate a while before she sells it um, and and right now uh, she is at the uh, museum. Um, let's see. She has an empty slot. Learn the networking skill. Have a child. Let's do that one because that's more. That's that's more possible than um. Okay, so so after he goes to the consignment store he's going to go to the museum and then he's going to take his wife out to dinner and then they're going to woo um she is at the elixir shop and she is going to uh, do some gem cutting um and harvest some honey um and then and then we'll see what else we can do here so i'm going to go ahead and Press play and find out what happens. I know this episode is getting long, so um, I'm gonna try and and get it down to about 40 minutes or so. So let's find out what he's going. Oh, um, he earned a raise. So instead of 22 simoleons an hour, he's making three. I'm sorry, 25 simoleons an hour. And I seem to be lagged, so before I start the next episode, I'm going to have to um, reset everything. Um, he found some bottles of nectar. He's going to buy an aging rack. Um, and you will notice... <coughs> oh, good. That's good. We have sold some stuff, so that's fantastic. Congratulations, you sold items worth 949 smolians. You have been charged $1 in consignment fees. Here's a summary. So we sold some ghost chili, the uh, university kit. Wow, okay. I'm like 
really super lagged here. This is really frustrating. Um, so let's pause. Maybe. I'm going to put some lip balm on my lips here. I don't know if you'll be able to hear it or not, but if you do, I apologize. One dollar in consignment fees, you know, it went up like three grand, so I'm wondering what else was sold. She sold a lot of vegetables. Okay. Alright, let's go. When he... Oh, Lindsay Raymond... I'm still lagged, but you know, there's not a really whole lot I can do about it. He wants to rock in the rock. You know, you're not going to do that. He wants to t send a text. He wants to learn the networking skill. Uh, he still wants to give a gift to Dina. I'm trying to find something that he can give to all of his wives. Um, he needs to learn the guitar skill. Okay, well let's go ahead and press speed 3 because I really want to get this day over with. Um, <laughs> Barso Miss Vadula Cog. Inza Wama Zabalu. Blaga? Alright. Holy crap on a cracker. Did you see that? Buy a gem cutting machine. We might do that. Lorsham. Wamita. Mm hmm. <laughs> Alright. Let's see. Let's get that amethyst. Let's get that. Gnomes, yeah, no, no gnomes. Okay, thanks. Bye. Bless you. Let's put this gem in her. Oh, he's traveling. She's hungry, so let's Oh, she's inspired. She might be able to do a good painting. If I can get her home in time, but I doubt it. We'll have to have her. We should get her a, um, we should get her a portable, um, what we'll call it? A portable, a portable easel. That would be cool. And I'm thinking that I should maybe put down the new venue that I got for my birthday, um, the uh, the Prism Art Studio. I'm so excited. Um, yeah, I'm I'm super excited. 
okay, all right, all right, let's, let's give, I can't give gift? Why not? Let's give it to Hope. And then we will I made Let's see, let's do some smoothing admire. I wanna get them to I wanna get him get them to the woohoo part so that you can so that we can end this episode because it is getting a little long. Um it's it's up to forty minutes right now, so uh chat we will ask her out on a date take her to dinner um and then okay let's Go to the bistro. Eat outside with hope, and then then can they see a movie? We'll do, do Love and Truffles. We'll go see a sappy movie with the wife. Not that wife. This wife. And then they'll see I'll see if they can they can woohoo in the movie theater. That would be Biff, um, so yeah, okay, let's check in on Meryl, how's she doing, whoa, that was freaky deaky right there. She's, she's thinking about baby blocks. See, she wants to have a baby. They all want to have a baby. And if I can just... Hmm. Hmm. Play chess with Mark Pleasant. Um, I'm hoping that this will count toward her career thing. Um, she's gonna have to eat soon though, and use the toilet. Let's go ahead and check in mm. on. Hmm. How she's doing with that. Oh, bees. I hate bees. Okay. What's going on here? Um... She's going to give this painting to, uh, Hope. Ooh. 
Alright, so... What did we lose six millions for? Congratulations, Meryl is leveled to four. What a beautiful, thoughtful gift. Um, okay. Okay, let's see. Um, I'm gonna... Great quality. We need to make a, a basement so that we can store this nectar. Um, okay. Admire, chat, ask on a date, eat with others, love and truffles. I'm gonna have her I'm gonna have him give this to um uh to Dina as a gift. Um so let's She wants to what is that? What is that? She wants to win the lottery. Well, I don't know how good that's going to go. She still wants to learn the charisma skill, I thought. Does that take a class in charisma, or... Oh, she wants to learn it. Okay... I can't handle those bees, they annoy the crap out of me. I hate bees, they're so loud. Okay, I'm lagged. I'm so lagged, this is so irritating. You have no freaking clue how irritating it is. Alright. Come on, come on! Bye. Okay. And then let's go see how she gets on. Come on. Hmm. Right there is. Okay. What's going on? There's life fruit and flame fruit over here. I'm gonna have um, Dina come and harvest it when she can plant it, so that they can make money from the life fruit and the flame fruit. There's also a death flower, but I'm not. I am not gonna harvest that. I don't want Dina to die. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Do you think that they're going to be able to to handle these different um um self-employment hmm. career things? Okay, girl, you need to speed this along so you can go take a pee. And you're hungry, so you'll need to go home. After that, go home. Oh god, oh god! Zirti Shunka! Hmm. 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 See, I'd be happy to hang out. I want to go see a movie or something. It's great. Okay. 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 Ok
Okay, why did they get, why did she get twelve dollars? Did she win? Darn Skippy, that's the way to go, sister. You get on with their bad self. Twelve dollars? Yay, you. Okay, go to the bathroom, listen to a dab gas, and get your butt home. And then they are going to dinner. And she's harvesting bees. She is not yet self-employed, but she will be um, in tomorrow's episode. Um, after that, go home so you can take a shower. All right. Dude, really? Put some clothes on. <laughs> Don't know who you are, but put some clothes on. I thought about picking the flowers and, and selling them, but some of those flowers are ridiculously priced. And we seem to be doing okay. As long as we can pay the bills and and afford the children, then I, you know, it doesn't matter to me. Come on, get on with it. I'm seriously lagged. They done with dinner yet? No. Mamu, ta. How are they? Are they even there? Oh, they're eating outside. Oh, that's great. Okay. Um, when I had, when, when I used, uh, Enros's, uh, debug enabler to change the relationship of, wow, that's loud music. When I used the debug enabler, Enros's de blah, 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 debug enabler, um, I, uh, And, and I married Dina and uh, Travis, and then Travis and uh, Meryl. Um, he got 10,000 life points, which is why he has the no jealousy thing. That way, um, that way uh, the women, they don't get jealous when... Uh, they might have issues with each other, but they won't get... They won't... They won't accuse him of cheating, as far as I, I, I can tell. Um, but but we'll see. Let's see what they're eating. Let's see. Um, Travis is going to eat some lobster, and that looks like oh, it's ala masala. It's alu masur curry. Okay, all right, that's fine. Um, need to hurry up and eat though. Him having a career might prove to be difficult. Because it takes so long for them to do anything. Oh, they're eating together. Aww. That is so cute. He wants to give flowers. 
Oh, he wants to have a great date with Hope. We can probably manage that. Um... He wants to... Now they're gonna go see a movie. I'm gonna see if I can get them to woohoo in the movie theater. Try for a baby. That would be fantastic. I hope that they they get pregnant because you know the more children they have, the better it is. And I have the mod installed where I can have more than more than ten um, or more than eight Sims in a household. So I have thought about getting a dog or a cat or something, but um, we we might do so when when we have a baby. But um. But right now, you're not going to sleep. You're going to go woohoo. No, take her to the movie. Are you serious? Uh oh. Oh, was that too hot for her? Oh, she wants to group up. Um, okay. All right. Well, movie theater's not gonna work. I don't think. No, we've missed the movie. So let's. Uh, is that our house? No, that's not our house. Where's our house? Oh, so the other way. All right. Fine. Let's go. Okay. Let's. Let's try for a baby with hope. There. Okay, now. When she gets home, she needs to, uh, come over here. Needs to use the toilet. Take a shower. And then... Eat. Um, how about you eat some leftover lime pancakes? And then she is on her way home. She needs to eat. When she gets home, she can listen to. Oh, she's already listening. Okay, so she can eat some waffles. And then. And then she can go up to bed. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, and then after she eats, that's eight, so yeah. All right. Come on, come on, go. Alright, let's go, let's go. Come on. Mashi, Nukasiara, Churabala, Matila Kamata, Makana. Come on. them loving it up mm. uh -huh. 
Lumina. Come on. Let's get on the ball. So this episode is long and I apologize for that. I'm going to try and make sure that the that future episodes are less than than 40 minutes cuz I know that the longer the episodes are the the more um the more difficult it is to to watch it all the way through and I really I really love it when you guys can can sit down and and watch an episode all the way through so um do you want tell me below do you want the episodes to be 20 to 30 minutes long or 30 to 40 minutes long or do you want a combination of both uh let me know and i will try my best to to do that for you uh, we're a little close taxis are loud let's come on i want to see you woo -hoo. well i don't want to watch them woo -hoo, but it would be great if they could get pregnant on the first go and it would be even better if they could get that taken care of before oh meryl is uh, writing skill level three that's good Come on, go, 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 go. Oh, okay, um, we're gonna, we're gonna buy those just because, um, Let's see. No, 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 I'm not done. I'm not done. I'm not done. Yes, I know. You're upset. Come in here. Use the toilet so you're not that bad. Use the toilet. And then we need to consign your junk. Come on. Come on, go. Get up there. Come on, come on, come on. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Oh, oh, I like her out sleep outfit. Come on. Have the baby. Get the pregnant. Come on. Why? You have a freaking... Don't you? Oh, there's not one in here. 
Fantastic. Meryl is going to have to clean tomorrow. Come on. <laughs> He's wearing a... You have to know that I did not make this family. All the credit to this family goes to... Of course. Of freaking course. Okay. Right. I want to get those smelted before. Oh shit, didn't. I get those smelted. Well, baby or no baby? Fantastic! Miss Miss Hope is pregnant. We've got our first baby coming. That is so exciting. Um, tomorrow's day is going to be Merrill's, so expect a lot of chess playing, um, a lot of deep conversation. Um, I think he might take her to the movie theater. I don't know. Um, anyway, I'm going to end this episode here. And in the next episode, we will try and get our uh, lovely... Uh, what's her name? I don't know their names. How bad is that? Um, we will try and get another pregnancy going on. Her name is... She is Meryl. So she's going to have to clean tomorrow. Um, I will pick up in the next episode in the morning before Mr. Um, Mr. Travis heads off to work. Um, and I want to thank you all for watching. I know that this episode was long. However, I do appreciate each and every one of you, and I hope that uh, you are going to enjoy this LP as much as I am going to enjoy it. Anyway, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode. Bye!